he got me on money still He can do Welcome back with me, Krishna, again in this channel. Channel that always gives you the information about places in Bali with the update situation. How are you this evening? I hope you're doing good, stay safe and healthy wherever you are. Okay, tonight or this evening, I'm in Seminyak area. Since some of you would like me to see how is the situation in Seminyak, especially at night time. So tonight or this evening, let's go and see together what is happening. Anyway, I will drive you along the street. This is Jalan Praman, and later I'll continue to a small street, which is Jalan Mertesari, because someone asked me to see the situations in front or around the Maya Sayang area, guys. And then I'll continue to Jalan Kayu Aya, of course, and Jalan Pedi Tengah, guys. So don't go anywhere, and let's watch until the end of this video. Okay, so as you can see, this is the situations at Jalan Praman. And here on the right side, there was a nice cafe, but unfortunately, it's still very quiet. And here we are entering the small street, which is Jalan Markasari. So you need to be careful when you drive here, guys, because it's, uh, as you can see, very dark. Earlier, we passed by the mini mart, it's open, and here on the right side, it's very dark here, I don't know what it is. Here on the left side is the mini mart open guys and also some shops so if you like to do some shopping around here you may do so and here on the right side i think this is the maya sayang bar and resto anyway they have their hotel as well so as you can see this is the situation they are open but still very quiet i think Okay, so we are arriving here at the main road, which is Jalan Kayu Aya. So if you go to the left here, you will go to La Bavela, Red Carpet, and etc. But this time, I will take to the right, and let's keep driving along this street, guys. And here is Nirvana Spot Bar. As you can see, guys, there are so many people there. Enjoying their time, enjoying the drinks. And here is the Upasha, they have uh, live music there. He got me on okay, so let's continue, let's keep driving. Here on the right side is the big spa, it's Carla Spa. And then also next to it is the Chandi restaurant. Of course, this restaurant is also open. Anyway, it's quite a famous restaurant around in this area. So how about you? Is that your favorite restaurant as well? And here on the left side, a lot of shops open. And here on the right side is the Mikonyas restaurant. Look at that guys, there are so many people enjoying their uh, dinner here. I'm really glad to see it actually because every time I pass by at evening time, there is always busy there at the Mikonya guys. We are getting closer to the Seminyak Square and as you can see a lot of shops, almost all the shops around here are open. So in the front is the Seminyak Square is also open. But this time I will take to the right here. This is Jalan Kayu Chundana and let's see what is happening. And here on the left side or in front of us is the Seminyak Village Mall. 
By this time, the Suminyak Village Mall is still open. It is around 7.30 actually. And here is the Postman Cafe and next to it here is the Sister Field Cafe guys. I think maybe some of you know about these places. Okay, so let's continue here. I will go to the left and we are entering Jalan Kaya Jati. And as you can see the situation, the street is quite busy. There are a lot of cars coming from the opposite side. And here on the left side, there are some shops that still open. So if you like to buy some souvenirs or bags, you may do so. And nice to see some people still walking around in this area. Definitely here in this area is very dark. Nothing is open. But next to it here on the left side, there are a lot of shops open and nice to see some tourists walking around. And here on the right side is the tattoo studio. I think this one is quite new. So if you like to make tattoo there, you may do so. But anyway, when you make tattoo, I think you have your own favorite place in Bali because there are so many tattoo studios in Bali. Here on the right side is the Ayam Kadewatan restaurant, quite busy also tonight. And we are getting closer to the Mexicola. Let's see the situations. I think it will be busy. And here in the front guys, on the right side, this is the Mexicola. It's uh, quite busy but not as busy as like a few months ago, like maybe one month or two months ago. It was so crowded here, there were a lot of traffic and people. But tonight or this evening, I think they are doing okay. There are some people here. Yeah, as well on the right side as you can see it's a nice place have you been to this place before and here is shrimp peas i think quite a nice restaurant the last time i passed by here it was so busy but tonight it was okay there are some people there Okay, so let's continue. We are entering Jalan Petit Tengah in Samina. On the left side, there is a restaurant as well open, but still not really busy. So far, what do you think about this area, guys? Would you like to stay around in this area? I think along this Petitengat Street, it's good to stay as well because it's not really far from the beach. There are a lot of shops for shopping and also there are a lot of restaurants. Anyway, it's kind of like close from everything. Okay, let's continue. Here's a bit of traffic. I don't know what happened. These two cars are stopping. And here on the right side is the Dash Hotel. Still very dark. But here in front of the Dash Hotel, this is the Montego Resort. 
I think this one is also quite a famous resort for people to stay because I've been to this resort a few times to grab my guests or to pick up my guests when they book tours. And here is the Padogo head if you go to the left. But let's go and keep driving straight, guys. Sign this famous restaurant as well. It's Biku. Have you had your dinner maybe at Biku? And here on the left side, there is a cafe or bar, Red Ruby, I think the name, but it's not really busy tonight. On the left side is the Shishi nightclub. From outside, looks very quiet, but I think they have some people there. Here, in the left side, is the government cafe. It's nice to see some people there as well, having their dinner. So I think generally, Seminyak area is okay. Most of the businesses are open. Restaurant, cafe, bar, shops. But the situation is not really busy, guys. I think it's considered quiet. Maybe because of uh, the ticket price to Bali is really expensive. So I do really hope that the ticket price will go down so that people can travel to Bali again. Okay, everyone, that's all for today's very short video from this area in Seminyak at night. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to support me by subscribing to this channel. See you again in the next video. Thank you very much and bye now.